This is a breadfruit tree. Breadfruit is a species of flowering tree in the mulberry family. Its name derived from the texture of the cooked fruit, which has a potato-like flavor similar to fresh made bread. The trees are monoecious, with male and female flowers growing on the same tree. The male flower emerges first, followed shortly afterward the female flower, which grows into a capitula, which is capable of pollination three days later. Breadfruit is one of the highest yielding food plant with a single tree yielding 200 or more fruits per season. Here in Puerto Rico, breadfruit is called panapen or pana for short. Pana is often served with a mixture of bacalao, which is salted codfish, olive oil, and onions. This is what pana looks like when it's done. Other recipe for uses for pana are mafango, Tostones. This is Tostones de Pana. Cut it into chunks. You fry the chunks of Pana until they have some color to them. You take them out of the oil. You wait for them to cool. Then you get a Tostone maker. I will show you that in another video. You smash the panas. You can actually use a plate too. You smash the panas into the flat. Like this. Then these pieces go back into the fryer. And you fry them up. And these are testones de pana. And even lasagna de pana. Cooked mashed pana layered with meat topped with cheese. There's also a popular dessert made with sweet ripe breadfruit. Flana de Pana, breadfruit custard. Both ripe and unripe fruits have culinary uses, but unripe breadfruit is consumed cooked. Instead of potato salad, this is Pana salad. It's made the same way as potato salad, but instead of potatoes, they use Pana. And I tried some, and it's awesome!